Hey everyone, welcome back. So in this video, I'm going to answer another career related question by one of my subscribers. So the question is, sir, I'm working as a network engineer since two years, but I already learned manual cross automation testing. I don't have any interest in networking. Can I switch to automation testing? Now, very nice and fantastic question, I would say, because this has a couple of points that I always wanted to cover whenever I want to put my views in terms of career aspirations and your interest. So the first thing that I want to mention here is the person has been employed into a network engineering field for two years, two years experience into that field. And during that time, they have learned manual and automation testing already. The other important point is that you do not have interest in networking. Can I switch to automation testing? Now, the first thing is that yes, I totally understand that at this initial career phase, there are many doubts in terms of choosing the career field that you are looking for. So maybe network engineering field you would have got because you gave interview and you got selected and you started just to go ahead and get started with that particular job. But because that is not your interest and it's absolute valid point to switch to a field which interests you. The reason I'm telling you because if you keep working in the field that you are not loving or you do not want to go ahead and pursue it in a long term, then the work that you do day in day out in that particular field will fade after a couple of years. You will stop learning. You will lose interest into that particular field and eventually after some time, maybe two years, four years, five years, ten years, you will lose altogether interest into that particular field and you would want to move or do something else. So in the initial phase, as you are, you know, two years experienced person, during this time, you have also learned manual and automation test. Now, if network engineering field is not what you love, my personal opinion and advice is yes, absolutely. You can go ahead and explore option in the field, which you absolutely love and do and enjoy doing. For example, you have learned manual and automation testing. Go ahead, create the profile, create your do do some automation work on the test website or production website that you see uh, that are available publicly and have your GitHub, GitHub account to showcase your automation work in your resume. Now, while switching, you will need this two years experience as a network engineer. You need a valid reason to go ahead and why you are switching into this particular field. Now, during as a network engineer as well, you do some sort of testing as well. So make sure you use that previous experience and also showcase the testing work or testing experience or testing work and tasks that you did in this two year road highlight those that will make your transition easier and better into the testing field. Now all of this is based on my personal experience advice and how I have moved across right being in IT for 20 plus years I totally get the point that if you if something is not interesting you very soon lose the interest into that particular field I started my career as a technical support engineer in networking field itself so this person whosoever has asked this particular question is very relevant or very close to where I started my career now, since I started into that field, I was in kind of a similar situation and at a similar time, I transitioned or I started learning the testing because I found that more interesting and moved from there. Now, during that network engineering role, which was at the Linksys Cisco division, I also did some testing, so which I showcased into my resume after learning or doing ISTQB certification, learning testing uh, and little bit of you know, automation. I showcased that previous experience to transition into the full-time testing role and from then I have always been into testing and automation and I find it very good that I took that decision when I was in the early phase of my career. So this is this is my own journey and if there is something that interests you more, I will absolutely suggest that you pursue that particular interest but make sure 
डिपेंडिंग ऑन योर करेंट सिचुएशन यू टेक डिसीजन अकॉर्डिंगली आई डोंट नो वॉट योर पर्सनल सिचुएशन इज करेंटली वॉट योर प्रोफेशनल सिचुएशन इज करेंटली वॉट योर फाइनेंशियल सिचुएशन इज करेंटली सो मेक अ इनफॉर्म डिसीजन फ्रॉम वॉट आई हैव सेट दिस इज नॉट अ फुल प्रूफ येस एंड नो एंड गो अड एंड डू इट शॉर्ट ऑफ एडवाइस इट इज गिविंग यू द इंफॉर्मेशन दैट आई हैव so you know that things are possible and you can make informed decisions based on my experience my learning and what i am sharing in this particular video right so that's the disclaimer based on your personal situation circumstances whether it's financial personal whatever you make the informed decision from the information that i'm sharing in all these video see okay so that's all for this particular video i hope i have answered most of your queries here in the next video i'll take another question from another subscriber thank you see you in the next one